What's up guys? Welcome to today's video. We're gonna be working on the AU today. Big sigh because <laughs> this car's been in the jack stands more than any other car that I've owned. I've had this car up for the manual swap, all the suspension stuff, the exhaust, the, I don't know, just you name it. I've had this car up on jack stands more than any of my other cars. Uh, so today we're gonna be trying to fix that problem that we've been having since the beginning of that drift event, which was the lack of power that this thing has. Um, so a lot of you guys have given me some suggestions. Some of people have thought that it was the butterfly valve and the intake system. Turns out it wasn't that, looks like they're working well. And what we're gonna try to do is see if the catalytic converter is blocked today. If it is, then uh, I think you know what we're gonna have to do. Obviously, I'm not gonna say what we're gonna do. You already know what we're gonna do. But if you know what I'm gonna do, then uh, if it's blocked, it's gonna be temporary, temporary fix. Bam, 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 woo. This feels like I'm repeating my words, but I'm gonna say this again. If you guys have any suggestions before I give this a go, comment down below. I know I sound like a broken record because I've asked you guys so many times, but I do wanna reiterate, I've done so much to this car. I've done the fuel pump, the fuel filter. I've done 3.45 diff gears, which a lot of you guys for some reason think that's not small enough when I know for a fact it is. Um, we've also done oil changes, spark plugs, uh, ignition leads, you name it, man. I've done literally everything with this thing. So this is my final option. If this doesn't fix the car, if this doesn't fix the reason why we have a lack of power in this engine, then uh, we might have to do an engine delito. The weather's not ideal, it's pretty warm, but doesn't mean we're not gonna work in the AU. I'm motivated because I want to get this thing running mint. Anyway, um, I, I'm puffing and huffing and all that stuff because I had to actually put the ramps over at the back so that I didn't have to reset the springs and line them up as I, if I had jacked them up and jacked it up and put the stands on the pinch weld. So yeah, I don't have to line anything up. So I actually put everything back down and uh, we have the jack stands on the front. Anyway, the catalytic converter is pretty simple to remove. I'm not gonna be able to get too many good shots cause yeah, I'm lazy, but there's two bolts um, at the top right here. It's really warm right now. So I gotta leave, give it some time. And then there is also two nuts and bolts just over here where there's a flange. So we should be able to take everything off and uh, yeah, inspect the cat. <laughs> Fuck you. And also, fuck you. Holy crap. Come here, you piece of shit. Ah. Let's have a look, shall we? Oh my god. Oh, there's a lot of, a lot of dirt here. I can't see a thing. Had to move over here because it's raining. Oh, buddy boy. She's cooked. <laughs> no way. Before we get to doing you know what, what I'm gonna try to do is see if anything comes out when I th put some liquid through here. So I'm gonna chuck some water through um, and see if it's like gonna come out nicely. I mean, I know it's gonna come out dark because obviously combustion gives off soot and it's gonna be full of soot. I also think that I could potentially clean it and just run it like that, but I don't know. It shouldn't, shouldn't be clogged. I'm gonna see what sort of liquid comes out of this thing when I put some water through it first. Anyway, we're gonna start the car without the exhaust. Yes, because these Russian boys are here. <laughs> we're gonna there are. They're gonna. I don't know what it's gonna sound like. I'm a little bit worried. All right, we're gonna we're gonna start the car and uh, see what it sounds like. Next level. <laughs> Holy fuck. 
That was fucked. Let's do it again. No. <laughs> I'm done. I'm not doing I was that again. looking at him like, oh, it's not going to be that bad. We're looking at each other like, oh, it'll be right. And then we both just go. Ugh. <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. I kept my finger on my ear so I didn't hear anything. Fuck me. That was fucked. That was fantastic. Oh. That's what it's gonna smell like. Okay, so yeah, that was next level. Well, 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 we're all done with the uh, the catalytic converter. Uh, yeah, can't really disclose much, but um, it weighs a lot less. Like I said, this is a temporary fix. I don't want to be driving around too much with what I have done to the catalytic converter. I just want to see if this does fix the lack of power that this car has. So we're gonna chuck it all back in and hopefully that is fixed the problem. If not, there's one more thing that we can do and that is exchange my ECU for a petrol ECU. So Naki also has um, a full petrol car. Apparently they can be tuned a little bit differently to gas um, AU Falcons. So because this was a dual fuel, maybe the ECU is not giving as much power as it should when it's on petrol and it's permanently on petrol now because we've done a gaso delito. But uh, yeah, we're gonna just see what happens when we chuck the cat in. Fingers crossed that uh, fixes it. If it doesn't, then um, I'll be so upset. <laughs> okay, catalytic converter is now back in there. The piping is all connected. The four bolts are on. And we're going to start the thing for the first time. I'm really curious to see what it's going to sound like. Hopefully, it sounds a little bit better. Because the exhaust that I have on, really good note. But it's a little bit too quiet. Oh, it's a little bit louder. A little bit louder. Not crazy loud, but... It's definitely louder than before. I'll give it a tiny bit of a rev. It's not really warm, so. Oh! Oh! It sounds so good! That sounded really. It's like it might pop on D cell now. Show me pops? Yeah. Sexy cow! Let's go, I'll show you pops. Alright, I'll turn the car off. Sexy cow. Dirty cow. Whoa, what's going on here, bro? Mismatch wheels? That was that was like the most delayed pop I've ever had. <laughs> Damn, sounds good though. Vroom. What's gonna touch first? Our cocks or our stomachs? Find out in the next video. <laughs> <laughs> the roach has landed. Metamorphosized. She's back. Back from the cocoon. She's back. <laughs> So yeah, we're uh, gonna take this thing for a test drive. And of course, we've got a butt diner over here. Yeah, every single time, I'm the one who comes in the AU to <laughs> see if it's faster or slower. Literally, so we're gonna see, hopefully, Peter's like, yeah, holy shit, this thing's so much faster. If he doesn't, then I'll, I'm gonna have to, I don't know. Have to do the ECU. Yeah, fuck, fuck, get down. <laughs> bro, get that exhaust, bro. Listen to that. It's definitely got a lot more pressure coming through the exhaust. Like I could feel it on my legs way more. Interesting. That might be it. That might yeah, be Yeah, that could be it. All right, don't mind my sick, awesome glasses. I got these up in Queensland for like five buck. Polarized. <laughs> <laughs> but Dino, you but ready? Dino. Let's have a sauce. Pred predictions, what do you reckon? I'm sure it'll make a difference. It feels like it will. Yeah, because like there was so much more pressure coming out of the exhaust. Mm. I don't know if it's gonna be quicker or not. Just like putting my foot down there, it doesn't feel like it's nah, gonna it be. No, it didn't feel better then. Yeah, that was second gear there, you know? Alright, no cars behind me. You ready? First gear? Three, okay. two, one. Oh, that felt quicker. Yeah? I don't know. Okay, it low key feels a bit better, not it, gonna lie. It does feel it a bit better. It feels a little bit better. I don't know if it feels as good as um, Naoki's car still, but it feels better than it did before. Yeah, far out, interesting. But like down low, it still feels a bit weak. And then as soon as you like put it down a bit harder, yep. it felt way better. Interesting. <laughs> awesome. Nathan. Oh, that feels way better. That feels, that feels way better. better. That feels better. But second gear? Go, go, second, second, second. Nah, it still doesn't feel as nah. good. It still doesn't feel as good. It has its moments. Oh. Yeah, it does. It's like the low down's a little bit better. But like, I should be able to thrash Naoki now, like in theory. Yeah, you got a you got a three four five as well. He's got a three two three. Yes, unless I was lied to and I have a three two three, which I don't think I have because, like, you can hear his chirp versus my chirp. Mine's like a quick. Ch -ch -ch -ch. This is like. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Yeah. Oh yeah, it feels way better it though. It feels better in first. It feels better. 
little bit of a W that we've taken away from today. We've made the AU Falcon sound a little bit better. Have to agree there. Yeah, definitely. It sounds like deeper and more like round, grunty, I guess. Gruntier. That's the only thing that we've fixed. I feel a little bit defeated. Haven't been able to fix the thing. But there's one other thing I can try, the ECU. And if that doesn't fix it, BCT time. Anyway, because I feel defeated, we're going to get some boba tea. Um, of course, we're going to take the boba getter. The chaser. Boba. I need to get like a boba sticker somewhere on here. Someone send me a boba sticker. <laughs> hey. Okay, so I don't know what's going on. I haven't driven the car in a long time, but maybe I'm just not used to the ethanol spool because I was running on 98 when I left. But it's spooling in really fast, which is making me worried. It's like maybe the wastegate line is off. I don't know, but we'll see. We'll quickly check it. Like it's probably not, and I'm probably being paranoid, but with a car that costs this much money, it's probably safe and smart to check. Like... Uh, looks all right. Whoa. What the frick is going on? What's I'm just freaking out. I haven't driven the car in so long, so everything that like is making a sound or a creak or feeling a little bit different to the AU Falcon. I don't know, I'm just freaking out. mentioned in this video but I was on holiday last week um, and I rented a Hyundai Ascent that's what it's called yeah yeah I'm pretty sure jeez I felt fast man yeah I felt pretty good this guy <laughs> goes, yeah. away, goes away for a week comes back sits in his car and it's like <laughs> <laughs> that's shocking bro that happens holy that, shit that happens to me with the bike like I'm like uh, the 650 is so slow, this and that, and then I, like, I get back on it and I'm like, hey, this thing rips. No, that's not that old. Yeah, not that old. Oh man, this is literally smiles per gallon. You fill it up with some E85, it uses 30% more fuel, but <laughs> it feels freaking mad. It feels good. Man. So happy with it. Gonna make sure it's like super locked up there. Oh fuck, <laughs> it's not even locked. Whoopsies. This one's for bro. Boba. Boba. <laughs> My method is the stab straight through, but on TikTok, I saw some lady say that if it's like 45 degrees, then the pointy bit is dead on, like dead straight. So let's have a size. Oh! <laughs> Not bad, kind of whatever. Yum yum. <laughs> Yo, thank you all so much for watching today's video. It looks like we did make some progress. We got the AU Falcon feeling a little bit faster, but not to the point where we're on uh, par with Naki's car. But the next thing that we're gonna try is putting an ECU in there. So we're gonna borrow Nathan's uh, petrol only ECU. And if that makes a difference, then that's awesome. Then I can just go get an ECU from the wreckers. Um, but until then, the AU is still not as quick as it should be with the 3.45 diff gears. And we're just gonna have to just try everything to fix it. Really appreciate you guys sticking around to this part of the video. If you watched this far, thank you so much. There's a little bit more to this video than what's usual. It's not just car stuff. There's like a little bit of a, I don't know, me just enjoying some time, just chilling with mates and stuff. So yeah, well, mainly just chilling with Peter. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you all in the next one. Catch up.